During Christmas, most people worry about gifts, how much they can spend, how many gifts they can give. Well, I'm going to give you a few tips, ideas, or a few gift ideas that it won't cost you a penny. Uh, these are love, trust, patience. And basically what I'm saying with this is that the best gift you can give to your kids will be patient and to everybody else's. Patient to, to the kids, it's just understand them. Remember that you were a kid once. Remember uh, that when we were kids, we liked to jump around. We really liked to do silly stuff. And sometimes it's not about uh, being exactly correct and being exactly the way it needs to be. It's just let them be kids. Education has to be, can also be fun. It can also be done in a fun way. Um, give love. Uh, most people think, oh, if I give love and they don't love me back, I won't feel good. The good thing about love is that there's not a limit of the amount of, lo of love you can give. It's not like, Oh, I just give 50% of my love, I have to save the other 50%. There's, it's, that doesn't exist. You can, as you can love one person, you can love a million of people. Um, and I think that would be the best thing you can give to not only your kids, but society. Be patient and understand that we have different ways of thinking. I like guns, you might not like guns, maybe you like guns and motorcycles and we, we have to understand each other and we have to be patient and understand that, you know, uh, things don't roll and don't move exactly at the same speed that you want and the way that you want. Another thing I think is the best gift that you can give to your partner, to your wife, husband is being truthful, being sincere. There's nothing more important uh, than know that you can trust the person next to you, that no matter what, I don't care what that person is, I know I can trust. I know that whatever that person's telling me is true. Uh, be true to yourself, be true to your lovers, be true to uh, your family. That, I believe, are the best gifts and after that, you can enjoy everything else. Everything else comes secondary. Like my gun. I have this nice uh, 2011 pistol that I really, really like. It is um, one of the features that I really like about this gun is that um, the slide is cut in the top. So you can see right there. It's with a, I have a hybrid barrel. And uh, makes the barrel stay in the same align with the with the frame um, easy to acquire my sights um, and and I don't know it really makes the gun cycle really fast the slide is lighter than a regular slide and the finish I wish you had the uh, opportunity to feel it uh, Akai did a great job it, you can barely feel where where the slide ends and where the the barrel begins the front side is a fiber optic, very thin, that I really like for competition. It makes it makes you, believe it or not, more accurate than having a fat, you know, front side. Especially when you're shooting steel, a 15, 20 yard steel, uh, 8 inch steel. It makes it a lot easier having a, a thin front side. Same thing when you're um, shooting partial targets or thin targets. Having a thin front side makes makes it all. It makes a huge, huge difference. Um, another good feature I have on my gun is the, 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 the grip has been stippled and the bottom of the trigger guard has been cut as well. It gave me a better grip on the pistol as well. So yeah, this is my gun. Most people ask me why do you change a Glock that it's just like uh, I can shoot anytime, X amount of rounds without cleaning the gun and it works. And this gun, I have to clean it all the time. My magazines, every time I drop them to the, to the dirt, I have to clean them. But it's basically comparing a Jeep Wrangler, which 
would be the Glock, which I love, is fun and all that stuff, comparing it to a race car. A race car is going to be more expensive, a lot more expensive, a lot of maintenance, and a lot of things break. So, you know, it's just the adrenaline you get to the race car, it's, you can't compare that. So, that would be this. This is my race gun. So, anyway, I enjoy my gun. I give a lot of love, patience, and trust to all my friends. And I think at the, that's the bottom line. So, from my heart... To you, Merry Christmas, and remember, the best gift you can give comes from here. Bye.